Hey guys and welcome back to another Unreal Engine Marketplace video. Today we're going to be covering the August sale which means we can save 50% on over 2100 different assets from now until August the 6th which is this Sunday so make sure you get on there quickly. So I'm just going to be covering the top 10 ones which I have found and let's just get right into it starting with the forest pack. So this is a game ready pack with pines, firs and birches. So the pack includes meshes, mass materials, particles, terrain tile textures and scenes as well. The trees included are 5 pines, 4 birches, 10 firs and 5 roots. There is also bushes, grass, rocks and also utilities which are light beams and leaves. In total there are 98 unique meshes, all of which have custom collision. The vertex count has a maximum of 38,335, so that is the biggest vertex count on a tree, is 38,335. There are LODs and they are automatically generated. There are 8 mass materials and 47 material instances with 96 textures ranging from 512 up to 4k with the majority of them being 2k. So this one looks absolutely fantastic. You get a lot of assets in here for you to be able to build your own forest environment within your games. Normally this is £37.72 but on sale it is £18.86. Next up we have the Combined Animation Pack Unarmed. So this product is a package that combines two different animation packages, those being the Unarmed Locomotion Pack and the Cover Animation Pack Unarmed. So these packages are compatible with each other and have a total of 179 animations. Those animations are rigged to the Epic Skeleton, also including the IK Bones. Again, there are 179 animations, 74 of them are in place and 106 of them are root motion. So that adds up to 180, not 179, so I think this is a little bit of an error where they've written down there. But there's a lot of animations, with the majority of them being root motion. And there's one character in here. So there's not a lot to say on this one, as it is literally just you get what you see. It is animations and it's a package of two different ones, which again you can see on screen now. And you can see two full videos on their marketplace page covering all the animations. So normally this is £28.29. But on sale it is £14.14. .14. Now it is the spline based blocking and trigger volume. So this allows you to use splines to create non-standard shaped blocking volumes, invisible walls and triggers. And this one looks absolutely amazing and very very useful. Because that is one of the most annoying things about volumes in Unreal is they are just basically cubes or cuboids. Whereas this allows you to create custom shapes using splines. So this is a versatile system designed to simplify the task of zoning out your scenes and levels. Unreal standard blocking volumes are limited to trapezoidal meshes and the trigger system is similarly limited to capsules, spheres and boxes. With this asset pack you can build zones in any shape and size using the engine spline system. So this includes a single drag and drop actor for each spline, a passive and active blocking volume which means either simply stop your player and actors in their tracks or give them a little nudge back towards the playable area. There's also trigger volumes of any shape that can be defined by a spline, one-sided and two-sided collision, procedural content support, so you can just give the actor a list of spline points from your procedurally generated world and let this pack do the rest, which is also very, very good. There is a versatile shader for building aesthetically pleasing borders or set them to hidden and keep those walls invisible. There's an extensive set of parameters to tweak and customize the system to your heart's content and there is also clear and readable well documented blueprints to assist in extension, comprehension and learning. So again as I've said this pack looks amazing. So in total there are 4 blueprints in this. And there is also documentation linked on the marketplace page as well. Normally this is £14.13 but on sale it is £7.06. Next up we have the tile based minimap. So this is a system that allows for the creation of minimaps based on images broken into a tile grid. This is fully customizable with icons and GPS root supports. So the system is straightforward as it allows you to render top down images of your level within the Unreal Editor, allowing you to use them directly or export them into an image editing software. The system is simple as it allows you to create blips and icons for your objects using data tables and a single function from the provided subsystem. Multiple widgets can source the blips information at once. The system is dynamic as it allows you to create multiple grids in the same level and the system will dynamically switch between them based on the player location. So this is great for having interior and exterior and also multiple floors for the interior. 
So an example in the video is a car going into a multi-storey car park. So you go in, it's then an interior, and as they go to the different floors, it switches, and when they exit, it's back to the exterior map. This system is endless and the whole plugin is exposed to blueprints allowing you to customize it with the only limit being your imagination. So this features minimaps based on tile grids. You can capture tile images in editor, dynamic grid switching, dynamic tile loading, blips which are replicated, circle or rectangle zones and a GPS draw route support, no route calculations, only draw support. So there are three blueprints in this and 11 C++ classes and this is also network replicated. So if you want to have this in a multiplayer game, you can see where other players are on the map and also if they were to pick up an item, that would obviously remove the icon from the map. That will be updated as well. So this is absolutely perfect for a mini map in your game. Normally this is 42 pounds and 44 pence, but on sale it is 21 pounds and 22 pence. Next up, it is the abandoned school. So this features a large selection of props easily customizable material for the props, using masks for the glass material, and all objects use the nanite system except for semi-transparent objects. So in total there are 586 unique meshes, all of which have automatically generated collision, and there are no LODs because obviously it's using nanite. In total there are 131 materials in material instances, with 306 textures, with the text resolutions being 32 by 32, 1K, 2k and 4k. There's not a lot else to say on this on the marketplace page but you can see in the video the quality that you're getting from this pack it looks absolutely amazing. You could go as far to say that it could be photorealistic which a lot of that is obviously down to the lighting and post-processing effects but the meshes of this abandoned school in here which is over 500 static meshes allow you to create amazing looking environments as you can see here. I feel like this could be perfect for a horror game for example. Normally this is £51.88, but on sale it is £24.94. Now it is the Sci-Fi Trooper Man Volume 3. So this is a rigged, customizable Sci-Fi Trooper Man. And an important note is this is rigged, however it is not animated. The animations you see in the video are just the default third person mannequin animations, however it is rigged for you to then put other animations on there. So this features two materials for the best quality, those being top and bottom. 4K PBR textures, examples of instance material inside, it's fully customizable, and there's ready starter and customizable pawn inside. So this is rigged, and it is rigged to the epic skeleton, but as I've already said, this is not animated. There's one character, triangles being 21,918, and the vertices being 16,329, which for a character is very, very good. There's 14 materials and material instances, and 12 textures, all of which being 4K. So some additional notes on this are the rig has additional bones. I'm not going to go through all of them because there's quite a few on here, but there is a list at the bottom of the marketplace page where it says what those extra bones are, which is always something to keep in mind when you are animating this rigged skeleton and this rigged character. Normally this is £33 and one pence, but on sale it is £16 and 50 pence. Next up is the Prisoner Mocap Anim Pack. This is a realistic animation that was shot using mocap technology designed for game dev. So this is a pack with lots of prisoner animations, 128 animations to be precise in FBX format, and it includes everything you need for the most common situations in a game where you are the prisoner or you have prisoners. So it consists of the following sets, those just being style 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5, and a surrender set. So there are 5 different styles to choose from as well as another set of surrender animations. So each of these different style sets have the full set of idle and transitions, and the pack also contains locomotion sets for style one and two, and the full list of animations is available in the pictures there on the marketplace page, which I'm not gonna say because there is an absolute ton on here, but you've basically got all the basic animations you would expect in an animation pack. Overall, the pack contains 128 animations plus four movement animations in place. So these animations are rigged to the epic skeleton and they do include IK bones and the animation type is both root motion and in place. Normally this is £37.72 but on sale it is £18.86. Next up we have End of Living Part 1. So this is the first part of the End of In world. The set includes a watermill and a small village and the props are ready to play. 
All the models are made in real scale and ready to use, and the trees, bushes and grass are also included in the project. So in total there are 137 meshes, 243 materials and 32 material instances, 656 textures, with those mainly being 2K, and there are 9 blueprint classes. So once again, as with some other packs, there's not a lot to say about this on the Marketplace page, but the video really just shows it off. This is essentially a water mill and a small village with some foliage assets as well. And they've said this is part one, so I'm guessing further parts will be released which will help to build up a full world environment set. Normally this is £9.42, but on sale it is £4.71. Next up, we've got the Human Wagon Rickshaw with animations. This human wagon rickshaw is a 3D model rigged and animated to mimic the real life wagon in games. This is rigged to the epic skeleton and it does also include IK bones and there are 26 animations. The animations include walking and running while dragging the rickshaw, idle standing and idle seated in as well as getting in and out of the rickshaw. Walking and running while turning right and left 45 degrees are also included and those animations are handy for blend spaces to create smooth movement. So the animation type is in place, there are 13 materials and material instances with 39 textures and the text resolutions are 8K. So you might want to possibly lower those down a little bit as 8K is very very high, especially if you aren't going for a realistic look. And if you want to know how to lower text quality then I will leave a link on screen now and in the description down below to a video where I go over just that. So this is quite a nice basic small asset pack here. Normally this is £18.86, but on sale it is £9.43. And finally, last but not least, we have the FPS Shooter Recoil Animations. This is easy to use, cutting edge recoil animation system for your FPS or shooter game. So this brings procedural recoil magic, so there are no more tedious creation of recoil animations, as this pack will lighten your workload, speed up your process and make your game run better. There are also over 20 customization settings to fine tune your recall animations. It's very efficient so you can share recall settings across different guns and save time. You can also adjust the recall animations in runtime based on weapon weight, add-ons or character stats. So for example if you were to equip an attachment to your gun or if your player has a skill tree you can lower or increase the recoil of your gun. There is one blueprint and six C++ classes and this is also network replicated. So this looks a lot better and runs a lot better as well. It's much more efficient than just using normal baked recall animations. Instead, it uses a procedural system. Normally, this is £14.13, but on sale, this is £7.06. So I think that'll be it for this video covering the August sale of 2023, where you can save 50% on over 2,000 assets from now until this Sunday the 6th of August. Again this was my top 10 which I found however there are of course thousands more that I haven't been able to see on the marketplace so let me know in the comments down below which one your favourite ones are and any which I have missed which you think should be shown off. So thanks so much for watching this video I hope you enjoyed it and hope you found it helpful of me just covering these different asset packs and showcasing them and if you did please do make sure to like and subscribe down below. So thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.